Hello, um, my name is Mario Rodriguez and I am the Chief Product Officer at GitHub. I've been at the company now six years, uh, since December 2018, but I have been doing tools for software developers now for over 20 years. Lately, over the last two years or so, has been all about AI. We were the first copilot in market, making those developers more productive and then allowing these organizations to continue to innovate at scale. Copilot and ARM, um, now they could do that. They could just kind of highlight some code in the IDE and say, how can I migrate this? But it's not only that. With the ARM extensions, I could say, give me a CI CD pipeline that makes this super, super easy, or get me started on a project as well. So we're kind of making the ecosystem of ARM, bringing it back into that developer, and not only that, giving them an AI per programmer right there that has all of the knowledge for them to go faster, learn more, and continue to evolve their craft. If I think about the GitHub Copilot ARM extension, there are three things that are extremely interesting to me. Number one is that we're bringing together two amazing ecosystems, right? Like the ARM ecosystem and then the GitHub ecosystem. And then kind of we're melding that together to enable scenarios that were not possible before. Sometimes I like to think about these things as like one plus one equals three. And so let's take as an example. Imagine um, I'm a developer in one of these companies and I'm actually doing a migration. And I haven't actually done any of these migrations before. Well, now I can use the ARM extension to up-level my knowledge overall. And that's super important. Like if I'm a developer, I always want to increase my craft um, on a specific item. So in this case, I could go in and talk to the ARM extension, figure out everything I need to know. Then I could go into the code and start my migration. Not only that, if I get stuck, I could then get help and you know some explanations, some fixes overall. So not only am I increasing my knowledge, but I'm also increasing my productivity as through it. And I'm increasing my understanding of the ecosystem of ARM through it. Then the third thing that I think that is incredibly powerful is how to actually do things faster. Like it, we call it like this vertical stack, right? So by just having CI CD integrated and actions already has those machines where you could build with Cobalt for as an example, then we're kind of minimizing not only time to market, but time to innovation. Recently, we were meeting with InfoBagnus and they were speaking about utilizing a lot of these tools to be able to allow their customers to migrate to the lowest cost, most power efficient ARM servers. And again, if you think about that, that's how we end up increasing innovation. GitHub and ARM have this very strong partnership, you know, and at the end, if, if we think about the outcome that we want is for these developers to develop faster and more efficient for those for that ARM platform. You know, the heart of GitHub is developers, but the heart of every application is gonna be compute, right? So that application is gonna have to run in some CPU or in some GPU. So those two things kind of go in hand very, very well. We have over 150 million developers in our platform, and our ARM has over 300 billion devices out there. We have over 3,000 enterprise prices actually coming in and setting up these jobs with actions and making use of our accessibility and partnership together. We have 11 million jobs already executed and over 250 million minutes. Like think about that, that's a quarter billion minutes already in the platform through this partnership. And in my opinion, we're just getting started. If we look forward to the evolution of this partnership, I, I, I like to think it mainly about what are the problems that we're solving for our customers. 